Welcome to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we're diving into one of China's most ambitious endeavors, the $62 billion water transfer projects. Join us as we explore the monumental engineering feats, their impact on the environment, and the implications for China's water-scarce regions. Let's quench your thirst for knowledge. While large-scale space travel remains a distant prospect, you can embark on a cosmic adventure in Suhai, China. Meet the Chimalong spaceship, a building that might remind you of the cruise ship from the fifth element. It's truly a world of its own, with an expansive ocean area covering 400,000 square meters and stretching 650 meters in length. Visitors can explore three floors, including one underground. Dive into the world's largest aquarium, boasting a mind-blowing 56 million liters of water. But that's not all. The Chimalong spaceship also flaunts the world's largest curved screen and the most capacious entertainment. It's an out-of-this-world experience you won't want to miss. China's engineering prowess is truly impressive, evident in structures like the Hong Bridge. This colossal cable-stayed bridge, stretching an impressive 11,072 meters, features two levels, an upper level for a six-lane highway and a lower level for train tracks. At a towering height of 330 meters, it stands more than three times taller than the New Century Global Center. The construction of this remarkable bridge spanned five and a half years, earning it not only admiration from engineering experts, but also a place in several rankings, claiming the fourth spot among the world's tallest bridges. China, home to 20% of the world's population but only 7% of its freshwater resources, faces a significant challenge, especially in its arid northern regions. The efficient management of water resources is crucial for China's future growth and development. To address this, China has embarked on a monumental project, one of the largest in history, the South North Water Transfer Project. This colossal endeavor involves the construction of three canals, each spanning up to 1,300 kilometers. Annually, these canals will transport around 45 billion cubic meters of fresh water to the northern regions of the country. The canals are named Central, Eastern, and Western. The Central Canal became operational in 2014, the Eastern Canal has its first phase in progress, while the Western Canal poses an incredibly challenging task for builders, as it will traverse altitudes ranging from 3 to 5 kilometers above sea level. China's quest to explore the cosmos is led by the Qianyin, also known as Heaven's Eye. This colossal radio telescope, boasting a massive 500-meter diameter, stands as the world's largest filled aperture telescope. In simple terms, its inner surface captures radio waves across its expansive span. Launched in 2020, Heaven's Eye has already made a significant impact in the scientific community, particularly in revealing galaxies hidden from optical telescopes. Its potential for groundbreaking discoveries is truly remarkable. In 2030, the Shanghai Tower reigns as the tallest building in Shanghai and the world's third tallest. Its elevators reach unprecedented heights, but that's just the beginning. Estimates suggest that constructing this colossal 128-story giant cost a whopping $4.2 billion. The construction process itself is filled with impressive feats, like pouring the tower's foundations in just 63 hours, involving 450 concrete mixes. Notably, the tower's outer structure gradually twists by 120 degrees. The Shanghai Tower has a delightful surprise for visitors between the 84th and 110th floors, the world's highest hotel. For those who reach the tower's summit, a breathtaking view of Shanghai awaits at a height of 632 meters. It's an architectural marvel that promises an unforgettable experience. Our journey in China kicks off in Chongqing, home to the colossal New Century Global Center, a structure that holds the title of the world's largest building in terms of floor area, spanning a whopping 1.7 million square meters. To put that in perspective, it's equivalent to three pentagons or 20 Sydney Opera Houses. Rising 18 stories high, this mega-center boasts attractions ranging from an ice rink to an aquarium, not to mention a vast water park with a 5,000-square-meter beach. For a truly immersive experience, consider staying at the Five Star New Century Hotel, which is equally impressive. The most astonishing part? It was built in just three years. Don't miss the Tianan Radio Telescope, a vital stop on this extraordinary journey. The world's biggest electricity consumer doesn't hold back when it comes to power plants. Take the Three Gorges Dam, not your typical tourist attraction, but the globe's largest power plant in installed capacity. 
In 2020, it churned out a whopping 112 billion kilowatt hours of electricity, surpassing the entire electricity imports of the United States at 61.4 billion kilowatt hours. Building this colossal dam required a substantial $30.5 billion investment, and every cent was well spent. Beyond its power generation prowess, the Three Gorges Dam acts as an effective flood defense system and significantly boosts local navigation, increasing cargo turnover tenfold in the area. It's a marvel of engineering and innovation that's hard to miss. Shenhu Lake, China's third-largest freshwater lake, sprawls across a vast expanse, embracing approximately 90 islands. Among these islands, the largest one covers several square kilometers. With such an ample shoreline, it's no surprise that the Chinese embarked on a captivating project. Allow us to introduce the Shenhu Hot Spring Resort, a testament to architectural daring. Earning third place in the esteemed International Empora Skyscraper Award competition, the Sharonhu Hot Spring Resort stands tall at 100 meters and spans a width of 116 meters. Inside this distinctive bagel-shaped structure, you'll discover over 300 guest rooms along with amenities like fitness facilities, four restaurants, and a wellness center, offering much more to enhance your stay. It's a unique gem in the heart of nature. With a staggering 417.7 million vehicles navigating its roads, the challenge of finding parking space in China is monumental. Enter the visionaries behind a futuristic vertical parking garage located in Hangu who sought to find a solution. This remarkable structure, with a striking resemblance to a museum or theater, serves as a multi-level parking facility, accommodating up to 500 cars, all thanks to a robotic system for vehicle movement. The process is swift, with cars being retrieved within a matter of minutes. But this parking facility offers more than just parking convenience, it's also a delightful space for leisurely strolls, featuring a rooftop garden. What's more, on the ground and subway levels, you'll discover recreational areas and retail outlets. China's focus on innovation extends to addressing its ever-growing need for efficient parking solutions. Constructed in China for the 2010 Asian Games, the Canton Tower graces the skyline as the world's second tallest, soaring to a height of 604 meters. It's only outdone by Japan's Tokyo Sky Tree, which surpasses it by a mere 30 meters. But there's more to this tower than just broadcasting. Inside, you'll discover a world of wonders, restaurants, cinemas, exhibitions, and various points of interest. Of course, the tower's several observation decks provide stunning views at heights of 33, 116, 168, 449, and 488 meters. Notably, the tower's elevators are so fast that some tourists liken the experience to flying in an airplane. It's an experience you won't want to miss. In China's ongoing battle against air pollution, these towers are indispensable. They play a crucial role in combating PM2.5 particles, which encompass common pollutants like soot, tire debris, and industrial exhaust droplets. Rigorous testing by the Chinese Ministry of Environmental Protection confirmed an impressive 55% improvement in air quality near these towers. Each tower has the remarkable ability to cleanse the air at a rate of 30,000 cubic meters per hour. Their sleek design and soaring 7-meter heights not only seamlessly blend into urban landscapes but also draw tourists, making them distinctive landmarks in their own right. In the world of advanced fusion reactors, headlines about the HL2M tokamak often boast China's triumph in conquering the sun. This remarkable fusion reactor is among the most advanced worldwide, with the incredible ability to sustain plasma for approximately 10 seconds. This duration stands as a remarkable feat compared to other similar reactors where plasma retention usually lasts less than a second. Inside the HL2M, temperatures soar to over 150 million degrees Celsius, surpassing even the solar core, which is about 10 times cooler. The HL2M tokamak holds the potential to provide a significant amount of cost-effective, environmentally friendly energy, aligning with China's economic needs. As a result, plans are already in motion to launch an industrial version by 2035, followed by mass construction of thermonuclear power plants, scheduled to commence in 2050. By the end of last year, China had set its sights high on revolutionizing the future of energy. Let's dive into another remarkable Chinese project, the Raffle City Complex. This stunning complex consists of eight towers, with four of them interconnected by a central block known as Crystal, stretching over 250 meters in length. Inside, visitors can explore a luxurious observation deck, 
dine at restaurants, and enjoy a winter garden. The towers offer a plethora of activities, with the total floor area of Raffle City exceeding a massive 1.1 million square meters. Chinese ingenuity has reached new heights with a Biang elevator, translating to 100 Dragons Elevator. This incredible feat of engineering stands tall on a UNESCO World Heritage Site, making it the world's tallest outdoor elevator, reaching a staggering height of 330 meters. It's a true marvel. Passengers are accommodated in three two-story cabins, and the same journey on foot would demand at least three hours. But with this elevator, visitors can reach the summit in just about a fraction of that time. It's a true testament to human innovation and progress. Are you a fan of opera? In China, the love for opera runs deep, with over 360 regional variations. One remarkable testament to this passion is the Guangzhou Opera House. Its architecture beautifully evokes the image of stones sculpted by the sea's waves, paying homage to Guangzhou's history rooted in maritime and river trade routes. Inside, the theater is a spectacle in itself, with reviews lauding its acoustics among the finest in the world. The stage features an impressive set-changing and transformation system, and the theater includes multiple auditoriums. The larger one accommodates 1,800 spectators, while the smaller one accommodates 400. The construction of this grand edifice came with an estimated cost of about $200 million. This striking building is a tribute to China's rich opera heritage. China isn't just famous for its logistics hubs and big tech players like WWD and Microsoft. It's also a land of breathtaking natural beauty. Amidst this backdrop, you'll discover the Liwen Building, a striking fusion of nature and technology, its standout feature. A towering 108-meter-high artificial waterfall that spans four floors, all dedicated to the machinery that powers it. While it operates at a considerable cost and delights residents and visitors only on special occasions, the Liyuan Building's waterfall proudly ranks among the world's top 10 tallest artificial waterfalls. Interestingly, when the waterfall was first activated, some locals experienced a significant water wonder.